everybody, welcome to the Jaden Stitches Show. It's time for another crochet quick fix. So let's grab our hooks, grab our yarn, head on over to the craft table, and we'll stitch it up together. We're going to make a little granny style heart today. You're going to need approximately 20 grams or 36 yards of a medium size four yarn. I'm using 100% acrylic in a nice bright pink. You want a pair of scissors, a yarn needle, and the hook I'm using today is a 5.5 millimeter, also known as an I or a 9 in the US, or a size 5 in the UK. And if you haven't already subscribed, be sure to hit that button and the bell so you never miss another quick fix. And once you've got all that together, we can get started. We're going to begin with a cinch circle. If you have trouble with a cinch circle, you can do the chain ring method. So you could chain 5, join to make a ring, and use that as your circle instead. Once you've made your cinch circle, Chain two more, so you have a total of three chains there. That chain three counts as a double crochet. And we're going to work two more double crochet into our cinch circle, being careful to work over our little short tail. Three double crochets equals one shell. So a chain three equals a double crochet. That's three double crochet. That equals one shell. Chain two for a corner. And into the same circle, working over your short tail, you're going to work three more double crochet or a shell. There's three double crochet or a shell. Chain two for a corner and you're going to repeat this twice more. Three double crochet, chain two, three double crochet, chain two, all into that little circle. At the end of row one, you should have four shells or 12 double crochet. Each set of three is separated by two chains. Don't forget your last two chains. Grab your short tail, cinch up your circle so it's nice and tight. And then you're going to join with a slip stitch to the top of that chain three that you began the row with. And there you go. That's the beginning of our little heart. It's also the same way we begin a cranny square. We're going to slip stitch into the next stitch. So you're now working out of the top of the middle stitch of that shell. So you slip stitch into the middle stitch there of that shell. Chain one. And into the first chain two corner space, you're going to work eight double crochet. Eight double crochet all into that little chain two corner space. That's eight double crochet. You're going to chain one. Find the next chain two corner space. Work a single crochet into it. Just one. Chain one. Now we're looking at the shell that's opposite the one we started in the middle of. You're going to find the middle stitch of that shell. So skip that stitch. Find the middle stitch. Work two single crochet into that same stitch, chain one, and work two more single crochet into the same stitch. So the middle stitch of that shell gets two single crochet, chain one, two single crochet, all worked into it. Chain one more, jump to the next chain two corner space, work a single crochet in it, chain one, jump to the next chain two corner space and you're going to work eight double crochet into that chain two corner space. So eight double crochet. Once you've worked eight double crochet into that last chain two corner space, chain one, and then you're going to find the very middle stitch of that shell. So there's that shell from row one. We slip stitched into that middle stitch to start row two. So you can see that chain and the chain one coming out of it. You're going to slip stitch back into that same stitch. So slip stitch to join the row in the same place that you started it. Snip your yarn. You don't need very much tail. Fasten off. Make sure that's nice and tight. 
and then you can take a moment to weave your tails in underneath the stitches around the back of your heart. And there you go, one cute little heart. Now you can make a whole bunch of these and string them together for a sweet little garland just in time for Valentine's Day, or you could make some in cotton, and they make cute little facial scrubbies, also a nice little gift for Valentine's Day. Tune in this Friday and watch us turn this heart into an entire granny square. <laughs> That's it for now, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us for this little crochet quick fix, and we'll see you soon. Until then, stay safe, stay crafty, and have an awesome week, everybody. Bye! Please visit our shop and purchase a pattern. It helps support our show. And we'll put a link to our shop in the description box down below.